Hey everyone, I'm Lucy Trigobenko and you're watching Lucy TV. All the ladies, pay attention because today you're in for a treat. I'm lucky enough to be joined by Helena, a fitness guru. Thank you so much for being here with us today. My pleasure. Now, rumor has it that you know how to turn a woman into a sexy vixen. You're a founder and a creator of a new fitness program, Kama Aerobics, which has a very new and different approach to it. Why don't you tell us a bit more about it? Well, basically, Kama Aerobics, it's a program that focuses on your pelvic area. Um, pelvic area for every woman, it's our pleasure center. It's the part that we carry our children, and it's what makes you a woman. Um, it focuses on that, it also brings out your femininity, sensuality, and inspires the vixen in you. You know, this sounds very perfect for today's world because us women, we sometimes forget how to be sexy and feminine because we lead such busy lifestyles. So how does the program benefit a woman? Yes, you're absolutely right. In today's world, there's always so much stimulation. We always have such huge to-do lists. And sometimes we have to uh, take on so many different roles, uh, from demanding careers in the corporate world to perhaps juggling a few different roles. So it's so important to still to be able to put that world on hold and to just go inside of yourself and channel that inner femininity. There's already a lot of trendy programs out there for women like yoga and Pilates that kind of have the similar concept but not quite the same. So tell me, what does make um, car Kama Aerobics different from everything else out there? Well, yes, it does have um, yoga, Pilates. I would say it adapts some of the philosophies of those programs, such as it also focuses on your mind and body connection, the infusion of the two. Um, helps with balance and coordination. So, and then you have belly dance and ballet and it uses a lot of elements of that as well. So I would say it's a mixture of traditional dance meets the modern trendy workouts such as yoga and Pilates. The name is very unique and different on its own. Why did you choose to call your program Kama? Well, Kama, it's an ancient Hindu god of love and fertility, and the workout centers around the pelvic, which is known as a sexual core, which in turn signifies fertility. Um, and ultimately, that's the reason why. Okay, Helena, after all this build-up, I'm dying to try out some moves, so why don't you show me some? I would absolutely love to. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right, so I'm ready to learn all about Kama Aerobics, so why don't you show me a few moves? Okay, Lucy, so we're gonna start off with, it's very essential to have a pillow, um, because the exercise I'm gonna show you, we need cushion for the knees, so go down on the floor, go on your knees. As you're doing it, uh, flex your core. Flex it and suck in the tummy, because the posture has to be correct, it's very important. Then bring your arms together and flex them, push them against each other. So this way you're working your chest, you're working your upper core simultaneously as the lower core gets targeted as well. So, uh, and we're gonna start. Take a deep breath. Forget about the world around you and just go inside of yourself. Normally when you do this, you're gonna have, um, it's a good idea to have some spiritual music playing. I would really strongly recommend Buddha Bar, which is my favorite. So we're gonna go down, slowly go down, control it as you're going down. You wanna make it more difficult, more intensity. You only go halfway down, and then you stop, and then you come back up. And again, down and up, down and up, down and up, down and up. Beautiful. Helena, thank you so much, I feel great. I really feel like you awaken a little vixen inside <laughs> of me. So thank you to Kama Aerobics. My pleasure. And that's it for today. I'm Lucy Trigobenko. See you next time.